morning. It is Saturday. It's kind of cloudy, gloomy out, but I don't know. I woke up in a great mood. I woke up at like 9.15 ish. Um, naturally, which is great, because I don't like sleeping in super late. No, no, I feel good, rested. I'm gonna take you along this weekend with me. I'm so excited. I like finally see the light at the end of the tunnel because next week of school is the last week and then it's spring break and I'm so excited. Hilton Head Island, if you've ever been, I love it. It's such a little cute, peaceful beach town. Um, and we, our grandparents had a place there all growing up. They just sold it a couple years ago, but um, we like grew up going there since we were little, little, little kids. And it's just like nostalgic for all of us to be there. So us three kids, Connor, Mariah, and I are going with our grandparents and it's gonna be super fun. It'll be my first time traveling without my mom, so that'll be interesting. Um, but I'm excited to go because I haven't been in so long. You know how just life gets so busy and you just have things planned, especially like with competitive cheer and everything. Like I didn't have, I had breaks, but like I couldn't just like go. So I'm just so excited to go back and go to all the places that I grew up going and I'm just so excited to be there. It's not gonna be like super, super warm, which is totally fine with me. Like even if it was in the 40s, like I would be fine with that. Obviously I don't want it to be, but I just want to be there. Anyways, I'm so excited, literally dreaming about it. Uh, Mariah went and got us coffee this morning. Thank you for that. And, oh, I ordered, um, Mom, I wanna show you these two. I ordered um, a couple shirts off of Brandy Melville's website. I've been wanting both these for a while. And then Brandy Melville, like, they take stuff off their website. They only have like a select amount of clothes on their website and then sometimes they put them back up and whatever, whatever. Um, so I'm gonna show you what I got. Um, yeah, it's just, I think it's super like cute and delicate in that it's that grid pattern in a button. I love it. I think it's so cute. It's so you. So me. And then I got this one. Mariah, would you show this one up? I think this is so cute. I've been, so cute. I've been wanting this one for uh, actually a really long time on Brandy's website. And then it's like when I actually go to buy it, it's never there. So I'm super excited to wear those. I think I'm gonna wear, I think I'm gonna put that long sleeve one on today and wear it with jeans, like loose jeans. I don't know. Okay, you know, oh, people are gonna be like, okay, look, look. But you know like the like coastal grandma, like vibe? That is me. Like that is my room. My mom is laughing at me in the kitchen. That is my room. You are an old soul. Old soul. Um, so yeah, we are just eating breakfast and then I'm gonna go take a bath, wash my hair, and get ready for the day. And then my wheelchair people are coming because, don't even get me started. My wheelchair has been just causing me so much trouble. I'm like, first off, my legs don't work. Okay, fine. Get in a wheelchair. Oh, the wheelchair's not working? Okay. Like, you're my fake legs and you're not even working. Anyways, my wheelchair itself is fine. It's the wheels. Anyways, it's just my wheels, like my power wheels themselves. One of them stopped working and so I can't just use one and so it's frustrating. So I had to send them back to the like supplier people and then they had to send them over to Europe or somewhere, I don't know. And so I've just had my regular wheels but since my arms aren't super strong and like half of my, like my triceps, like I don't have triceps really. Um, it's very difficult for me to push, especially all day long around school and just getting to, to and from places. What's I talking about? Oh, my wheels. Anyways, um, my wheels being like causing trouble and being in these wheels has just kind of put a damper, obviously, on my mood and everything. If you saw my last video, um, but yeah, um, he's coming today, so I'm excited for that. And then today should just be kind of a fun, chill day. I think we're gonna go to, oh, record a podcast, which I'm super excited about. And then, um, go to Urban Outfitters. We could get Shake Shack for dinner. That could be fun. Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm so excited to go to Hill and Head and just spend time with my grandparents. I love my grandparents and just being around them um, and my siblings. I love them so much. Um, so I'm so excited that we get to go on like a little siblings trip and then our grandparents are coming too. And it's gonna be so fun. Like when I tell you Hilton Head is like my little 
safe haven place it is. It's just, it's precious. I just love it. Like, you wake up in the morning. Oh, I'm so excited. You wake up, you have coffee. Like, you sit out on the beach. <laughs> what was that? Oh. Mariah, tell them, tell them, like, the morning we're going to do. <laughs> this artist made custom earrings of Kevin's face, and yeah. they are so good. <laughs> that is so funny. I forgot about those. Anyways, we're going to go to Urban. Um, I want to get a cool pair of sunglasses, and I know I'm going to end up buying clothes, which is okay. I really don't buy clothes or like you know what this is for? I really don't buy things that much like that often the mo the most I spend on anything is food and drinks literally like every day and that's bad I was like coffee. I don't spend money that much coffee oh, and food almost every single day for like Starbucks or drinks um, you know what this Starbucks. reminds me of get, get, get your face in um, you know, like when you were little and you were about to go on spring break, you would go and like buy a pair of shorts, like you would go spring break shopping. Oh my God, spring break shopping! <laughs> Mom's going on her own and you vacay. Would, you would get yes. like, you would get like a few um, bathing suits. Yeah. And then you would get some shorts and a few shirts. I know, I'm like excited. You're lucky. Oh my gosh, okay. I just got the bath. I feel so clean. Mariah's going to, um, Blow dry my hair for me. I took an amazing bath. I smell and feel so good. I have my new top on. It's really soft. And I like that it's not a crop top. Like it's a full shirt, which is like, I don't know. I feel like a lot of, especially Brandy, but a lot of tops, they're just all like crop tops. And I wear an ab binder most of the time, like all the time, unless I'm like in a bathing suit or something. So I don't want my ab binder out. <laughs> and that just keeps my blood, blood pressure up. But this is a fit. I'm just wearing loose, light wash. Not light wash, just loose blue jeans and then my brand new mail ball top that I got. And then this is what an ab binder is. Let me show you. They come in different colors, but they're just white. And it's literally just like a wrap that goes around my core. And it raises my blood pressure because, as you know, I struggle with my blood pressure at super low blood pressure. And then I take blood pressure medicine in the morning and then at, like, noon, lunchish, um, to keep it up throughout the day. And if not, then I, like, I can't get out of bed, one, without my ab binder, and two, without my medicine. Like, I literally can't get out of bed. When I get up, I, like, you know when you stand up too fast and then... Like things get dark or like you can't hear, feel like you're gonna pass out. That's what I feel like. So, yep, we're going to do my hair now in the wheelchair. Guys should be here anytime. There's like a, you know, they have like a hour gap of when they come. So it just is about to start in five minutes. So we'll just be chilling here for the next hour. Um, and you can see my purple in my hair that I got in a week ago. And you just wash it like normal hair. And it's actually glued in. Um, it's not, oh sorry, well yeah, it's taped in, like glued in. Not sewn in or anything. And then it just grows with your hair and then. <gasps> Is that from me? I don't know. Yeah, it's definitely from me. I just noticed it. Oh, big push it back, push it back. Oh, oh, there we go. Okay, nice. okay. It's like a little door. Yikes. I'm glad I just kind of pushed in. Mm -hmm. yeah. Caregiver with my mom. Part time. No, yeah. part, I don't know. I, was, why, I almost said part time too. I don't know why I keep saying word. part time. Um, co. co. Co caregiver. Yeah. And yeah, I run Michaela's YouTube, I film for her. And then every or this it is drives like, me. You help drive to say, school. You, on the daily. You're kind of like you and mom are just like my parents. Like y'all both just school. like co-parent and take care of me together. Yeah, which is kind of cool. But so, also sometimes it sucks. Yeah. All right, we just filmed a podcast episode, and now Mariah and I are headed to Urban Outfitters, um, and just like a shopping outdoor shopping mall area, and. I think we're gonna hit up Urban for sure, for sure. And then get dinner while we're out, maybe. Maybe stop in another store, probably, probably not. I feel like we'll just be in Urban. Maybe, who knows. It's five right now, but it's like 
just gloomy and cold gross. and gross out. So, I mean, it'd be fine coming back here and chilling at home tonight after we get food and shop, but who knows? We're gonna run some errands. I got my wheelchair fixed, so excited about that. Hopefully Urban has good stuff. And then we'll do a little haul after. We're in the um, fitting room and we got some good stuff and we're gonna look at accessories after we try on clothes. Um, Mariah was like, I'm not gonna buy anything. And she's in a very pretty dress that she needs to buy for my graduation party. Um, but Mariah's gonna try on like the hard stuff and I'm gonna try on my tops that I picked out. I looked in the camera. I laid it in the mirror and I didn't see it. I know the dead end. This was in the sale section. So okay. there's only one, and it was our size. Um, camera's about to die, but we ended up getting. Almost all the things we'll we do showed. A haul when we get home. We'll do a haul when we get home, and we didn't get any accessories, did we? Nope. So we're going to go shopping a few more places, and get dinner, and then we're gonna go home. My okay, Kayla's already in bed, but we wanted to show you guys what we got tonight, real quick. So we went to Sephora. Michaela got two things. She got Fenty Beauty um, foundation, and then I don't know where it is, but since it's in my purse. Oh, it's in your purse. Let me grab it. Since Glossier is now in Sephora, Michaela ha loves their perfume. So she got their perfume balm. Mm. It's so good. It smells so good. So she's going to put this in her purse. And then from Urban Outfitters, we got five things. I'll show you what I got first. I guess it was in the lavender spirit because both things I got were lavender. I got this lavender tank top. I thought it'd be cute with white jeans. Just for the summer and then I got this lavender it's a midi dress so it's just like tied up here and then poofs out with some white heels it'd be so springy and cute and then Michaela got three things she got this white like a white blouse and the sleeves are kind of flared or like straight super cute and then she got this shirt it says keep the sea plastic free, but she loves the ocean. Anything ocean in blue, she's gonna buy. And then the last thing we got it was our favorite. Um, it was in the sale section and it was the only one they had and it just happened to be our size. I think we talked about it a little, but, oh, I showed it, but it's the um, jumpsuit. So anyways, that's what we got. We had so much fun together going out i'm editing my tiktok right now i did a get ready with me with paralyzed hands so go check that out we're gonna go to bed and then go to church in the morning all right good morning it's sunday morning we just left from church it's a gloomy day outside um church service was super good and um i did my own makeup again this morning and we are on our way home to just get a quick lunch and then change into comfier clothes. And then we are on our way to the movie theaters with our grandparents. We're going to go see the new Jesus Revolution movie. And we've heard great things, like so many amazing things. Um, so Ryan and I are both super excited to go watch it and then we'll tell you what we think of it. Um, yeah, I'm excited to go with our grandparents too. We. Us two and our mom, all three of us honestly, love the movies. Like love, love, love going to the movie theaters. It's just fun. I went to the movies last Sunday. <laughs> you did. <laughs> yeah, movies are just fun. I don't know, I enjoy them. So I'm excited to go and oh, wait, watch this movie. A few days later, per usual, but the Jesus Revolution movie was beautiful. If you haven't seen it already and it's still out in theaters, Go see it, it's precious. I personally didn't cry, but I know a lot of people have cried. A lot of my friends have cried. Um, it's just a really, really good story, and it's based on a true story. Um, and I love movies that are obviously based on real events, and then at the end, they show like real clips of the real people. Um, I don't know, I just think that's really cool. Um, I know they did that in Elvis, they did that in Whitney Houston. I don't know, I just, I think it's interesting. It's cool to see, um, but wow. So cool. I just, I really liked it. 
I definitely recommend that movie. If you haven't seen it already, you should watch it. Or if it's on like streaming services or whatever, you should try and find a way to watch it. It's really good and I really enjoyed it. That was basically it. Came home and chilled and watched Grease and went to bed and we're finishing the last week of school before spring break. It's Wednesday today and we're making it through. The next time you see this, Mariah just told me this, the next time you see me, I'll be at the beach and um, just by the ocean, which is really all I care about. So I'm so excited. Woohoo! Okay.